Top 10 Manhwa with Monster Protagonist Hey everyone and welcome back to our channel. Today we are counting down the top 10 Manhwa with Monster Protagonist. From werewolves to demons, this series will have you on the edge of a seat. But these aren't just your average monsters. These protagonists are complex and relatable characters that will have you rooting for them. So without further ado, let's get started. Let us know in the comment sections if you agree with our picks or if we missed any of your favorites. And as always, don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell to never miss a video. Starting off with our number 10, Call of the Spear. Are you ready for an epic adventure with the monster protagonist? Introducing Sun Gun, the Tiger Lord of Bake Mountain. Sun Gun, a powerful and peaceful tiger spirit, is living in a serene life until a young white-haired girl named Choa shows up at his cave claiming to be his bride. But little did he know, Choa is a descendant of the white-blooded demon beast, a creature feared by all spirits and beasts. Sun Gun tries to send her away for her safety, but he soon discovers that she has nowhere else to go. And so begins Sun Gun's journey of hardships and battles as he protects Choa and their newfound home. This manual is not to be missed if you need some monster MC then. Number 9. Is there a problem if the Demon King is a goblin? Follow the story of Alex, an elf who is on a vendetta against the Chosen Ones who kept the peace of the land for millennia ever since their ancestor defeated the Dark Lord Gob Khan. Alex seeks to destroy the world that has betrayed her, but her plans take an unexpected turn when she awakens the Dark Lord from his thousand-year-old slumber, only to find that he is a goblin. Will this small green creature manage to live up to his reputation and help Alex bring apocalypse upon the world? And will Alex's vengefully plan succeed? Find out in this thrilling fantasy series filled with action, adventure, and unexpected twists. Number 8. Legend of Mir – Gold Armored Sword Dragon the story follows Gold Armored Sword Dragon, a powerful boss monster and guardian of the abbeys who becomes self-aware and awakens in a game world. Guillaume Gob de Orion, also known as Gold Dragon, is a giant dragon covered in golden scales but can take on a human form once he withstands a set of number of attacks. He is a rare character in the game, New Legend of Mir, a supposedly authentic martial arts game. He is Dorothy, or the girl who calls him Guillaume Rong. Jiok Chan Won, the attack forces leader and commander of the Red Blood Group, and Gepeto, who goes by the nickname Dumpling Head Girl. Together, they navigate the world of Murim within the virtual reality martial arts game New Legend of Mir. Will they be able to survive in this game world and will they find a way out? Follow the journey in this action packed and thrilling story. Number 7 Dragon Ego Are you ready for an epic adventure inside the world's most popular MMORPG? Introducing Dragon Ego. In this thrilling story, the fearsome dragon of despair Tarfras is raided by the game's most powerful guild, composed of six top rankers. Upon Tarfras' defeat, he is divided into six items and split between each of the guild members. But little do they know, Tarfras' sister, Ignis, the dragon of destruction, has been awakened. Now to resurrect her brother, Ignis must take down the guild members one by one and unite the missing items. This is a dragon-sized tale of revenge filled with action, adventure, and unexpected twist. Follow Ignis in quest to bring her brother back to life and see if she will succeed. Number 6. Lord of Goblins Lev is a seasoned warrior who has spent his entire life fighting against the predatory system that ensnares the world's population, turning them into puppets for the leaders of humanity. But when he is assassinated, he finds himself in a new world with differently yet familiar evils. Now armed with a lifetime of experience, Lev must navigate this new world and take on the corrupt powers that be determined to bring freedom to the enslaved masses. Will he succeed? Follow Lev's epic journey as he fights for justice in a world plagued by corruption. Moving on to our number 5, Asura. Asura is a must-read manhwa for fans of epic fantasy and Asian mythology. The story follows Asura, the strongest demon of Tapana, who becomes bored and restless because he's so powerful that no one can sate his desire for battle any longer. 
But when a powerful being named Indra comes along and challenges him, Asura embarks on a journey to retrieve his four arms and face Indra. What makes Asura stand out is its strong incorporation of Buddhism and Hinduism into the story and characters. The themes and symbolism in the manhwa are heavily influenced by Asian religions, giving it a unique and different feel from other Asian comics. All in all, Asura is an excellent choice for readers looking for a fresh and unique fantasy story with deep cultural influences. It's easily one of the best comics I have read in a while and I highly recommend it. Number 4. I, the strongest demon, have regained my youth. The story follows Xing Sheng, a powerful demon king who rules the world. In order to maintain his rule, he goes deep into the demon realm to find the highest and strongest power. Thousands of years later, he has become stronger and younger and the world has also changed. As the story progresses, the plot may seem basic and the characters and their motivations may not be fully developed but the art is truly breathtaking. The illustrations are detailed and dynamic making the story visually exciting to read. It's a decent read but the real appeal of this manhwa is the stunning art. If you are a fan of stories and enjoy beautiful illustrations, this manhwa is worth checking out. Keep in mind that as the story progresses, the plot may become more interesting and complex, so give it some time. Number 3. Red Doll The story takes place in a world where mankind discovered a new world, but instead of peace and prosperity, the world turns into chaos. People began fighting among themselves to obtain crystals that give them superhuman powers. Our main character, Crazy Dog, works for an agency that is in charge of getting rid of these people. As the story progresses, Crazy Dog must fight humans transformed into monsters in a world where biotics and mercenaries are the norm. The story is not entirely new, but it is well executed and has interesting elements. Overall, if you are a fan of dystopian stories and enjoy badass characters and beautiful artwork, Red Doll is worth checking out. Keep in mind that the manhwa is relatively new with only 10 chapters released so far, but it is a promising start. Number 2. Carcerian Meet Karsarin, also known as Erin, the first ever dragon to run away from the home. Erin uses polymorph magic to transform himself into human and embarks on an adventure to the human world. But the human world is treacherous and Erin must navigate through dangers such as arcs, being sold away and even becoming a princess. As the story progresses, the real plot kicks in and the manhwa becomes more engaging. The characters are well developed and feels like a part of this world. And the art, although mediocre at first, grows on you as you continue reading. There are light comedic elements and political tension among different empires in the world which adds to the overall complexity and interest of the story. The main character, Eren, is a bit naive at first as he is a little dragon who has left home for the first time and goes through some character development. If you are looking for a proper fantasy webtoon with a unique plot and characters, give Karsirin a try. Keep in mind that it starts off slow but the real plot kicks in at chapter 9 so give it a chance. And finally number 1. Her Hero The story follows Taiju, a monster from the future who has been sent to change the past. His mission is to remove one woman, Jung Eunji, in order to change the course of history. In order to approach Eunji, who is a hero, Taiju must also become a hero. As the story progresses, Taiju is faced with a moral dilemma as he must decide whether or not to remove the threat and change the future. The story is more focused on friendship and self-discovery than romantic quest and leave readers with unanswered questions that make sense in the context of the story. Don't let the cover fool you. This manhwa is well written and has a unique plot. If you are looking for a story that is focused on friendship, self-discovery and time travel, give her hero a try. In conclusion. There are many great manhwa out there that feature monster protagonists, each with their own unique story and style. From Sangun, the Tiger Lord of Big Mountain, to Asura, the strongest demon of Dabana, to Singjen, the eternal demon king, to Karsirian, the first ever dragon to run away from home, and finally Zung Yunji, a monster from the future. Each of these manhwa offers a unique and exciting story that will keep you hooked. Whether you are a fan of fantasy, action, or science fiction, there is something for everyone in the world of manhwa with monster protagonists. Don't forget to check out all of the titles listed and discover your new favorite manhwa.